decolonisation uh, for us at the moment is a is certainly a journey, and it's one that the leadership team stays really focused on by having an objective to create one organisational culture where we embrace the best of all the different cultures that we have, particularly our headquarter culture, and make an organisation that is truly an Australian local organisational culture. For us it's about managers being aware of cultural differences and having the context around why those cultural uh, differences exist. Our managers need to know how to be a global leader. They need to understand and appreciate um, that cultural differences exist. And so to be the best leader they can be, they need to understand that sometimes the way we lead in an Australian context might have to be modified or adapted to suit our organisational culture. And so we provide training, cultural training uh, and uh, management development training specifically focused on that. and I think we use a number of different HR metrics to support that. The first of that is our turnover figures and particularly our turnover figures and attrition in the first six months of employment where we find that that cultural clash is most prominent for new employees. So we measure by looking at that figure in particular and getting exit interview data as we have people leave the organisation. I also think it is, in, it is possible to measure it through um, things like engagement surveys and culture surveys where we're actually seeking the feedback from our employees and they're telling us whether or not we've made progress. I think positively, and for us that is because we are really marrying the best of, of the culture from a product perspective and innovation that we have from our headquarters through to making that work in an Australian environment and making sure that our products are marketed and built for an Australian consumer and for an Australian end use. And having that cultural harmonisation, being able to uh, tell product development areas what we need from an Australian perspective um, has been really critical and it impacts our ability to drive sales.